company. This is John Bain. I want to welcome you to Pixar. Looking forward to having fun with you guys today like we do every day. Hoping that you find something you like, find something you like. Don't forget to slam the like button. It does help me a lot, and I really do appreciate it. If you guys are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Always got something new coming out for you. Love for it to be here when that happens. Yes. I would. And we are here upon the server of the Pooping Evolve. And as you can see, there's a big hole in my place. Uh, this is post-stream, big hole in the place. Had an issue, too, with a plant deciding to grow right here. And that plant, um, well, it's dead. I figured out, I, I, I dug out underneath it and speared it to death. Let's see, can we pick you up and just demolish you? Because you're of no use now the way you were set. Let's go pick up these pieces, too. Anyway, we had a plant problem. And um, I disposed of that. I also lost the Pteranodon, a uh, really nice one too. It was like at level 55 and it's gone. I'm clearing up these blocks for a specific whole reason. We'll show you in a second. Uh, let's grab these out of the way too now. Uh, it wasn't letting me get rid of them before. Now I can, very nice. So as you can see, this is a little bit of a hot mess out here because I've cleared this out. I've also need some water. There we go. Okay. Need some water. I've also cleared out a huge area in here. I went ahead and filled it in with some blocks. You guys have been watching the streams and stuff like that. You know the deal is with this. This is the fine stone walls and fine stone floors and some ceilings here. Also, we had some leftover glass, too. This is the new Pteranodon, which is not as good as the old one, but it's still Pteranodon nonetheless. It's moving very slow because I am weighted down like crazy right now. All right. So, um... Uh, you know, and we have the two raptors, which we need to go ahead and name them. Um, I think we're going to call them Bobby and Bobby because I kind of like that name. I like that name. So we'll do this one. This is a lady one, so we'll call you Bobby. And this is a dude one, so we'll call you Bobby. You know what I'm saying? JB and Bobby. Bam! We got Bobby and Bobby together now. These were pretty decent teams. 47 and a 48. Got more eggs. Very nice. I put the eggs back inside them, if you can tell. Well, you need meats. You all need meats. Okay, uh, a lot of things need to get done because our... Well, as you can see, we finished the last of the stream. We have storage areas now. And I just cut open this piece here so we can get into here and maybe make another, put up another door. Now you maybe put up another door because this is our storage area. So we need to, be able to get in and out easily. Now, how I got all this stuff excavated really fast is this drill. <laughs> I was kind of toying around and uh, found it and realized I was high enough level to learn it. It's in the mechanical metallurgy section, I think it is. Yeah, there it is. 34 to learn it. A mining drill driven by coal. It can be. It can collect minerals with high efficiency. It can only be crafted at a workbench. Fires, copper, most we have. Look at this. This thing does a two section. Like, let's go over here. Um, right here, right here. Watch. I didn't do it right. I, I sucked. There you go. You can see like that. Bam. Also, if you do the higher end of a too high, it will get rid of all of it. So it's actually pretty nice for those reasons. <laughs> this is so cool. I have to say, I really like this thing. It's going to make mining uh, an actual fun, ex more fun experience. It's already pretty, you know, fulfilling when you find stuff. Like I've gotten way too much copper now to where copper is not really fulfilling anymore. Uh, which sucks. All right, the miasma is in now. This, I guess we found out since moving into the swamps, there's this poisonous gas that'll come up sometimes. That'll sometimes knock you out. My my fortitude is up high enough to where it, really, it doesn't affect me. Let's get some more water while we're here. Uh, there, uh, there were, okay. So anyway, um, also logging on when I'm losing that and that plant was there. I was like, uh, we really need to get a better entrance and keep all our dinos inside. So that's why I dug out a whole area. This side was going to have a bedroom on it, but I think what I want to do is leave this lower section as our dino storage area. And then once we get that, like, looking all nice and shiny. We need to get rid of that thing there. He's out. Okay. And once we get all that done, then, um, you know, move these guys in here. I want to put some ceilings up and stuff. But uh, what else are we looking at? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. We need to get some woodses. I think that is a major thing. So what I'm going to do, I want, oops, I'm going to empty up my inventory and... Maybe try to move. Can I get all? Holy crap. Can I hit you the other way? There we go. Okay. Just, I had to do that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. 
Okay, so what I'm going to do is empty out my inventory into this, the places where I have discerned. Watch this, watch this too. Let's make sure we get that and transfer same items. Bam! Is that not cool or what? You better not say or what. That's all I got to say. So we can transfer all tools at once. Oh, we also, I made a bunch of piping plumbing stuff to get our plumbing back in here. Let me put these guys in here. Oh, and this is something else. I went and decided to go hit up some beacons. And we got a bunch of these these blueprints. Now, with the blueprints, if you look at the, craft, the Ingram side of things, the architectural master, there is a bunch of these Western things and all these other things in here that it says part of it requires learning the corresponding blueprint, which is what we've got a bunch of. Well, I say it's a bunch of, but it probably isn't a lot to people. We got a Western roof blueprint. Let's use that. Ah, uh, let us learn it. A firefly wall lamp. Very nice. What is this? The Western ceiling blueprint. This is wood, I believe. We have Western wood door blueprint. Western wood bed blueprint. And then a Western storage box blueprint, which I think might be really nice. Oh, we got a bunch of those, actually. Uh, yeah. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. And we got some dirt we need to get rid of. We got some other things we need to get rid of. So what I'm going to do is get rid of some stuff, and then we're going to go ahead and go and uh, gather up a bunch of wood, and uh, we'll be right back. Welcome back. And I might look at pteranodons on the server has been just crap, like keeping them. But then we just knocked out a 58 pteranodon and threw meat on it. It still isn't eating yet. Oh, boy. This is going to be a little bit of a long tame, I think. But I just want to show you guys this because I was pretty happy. There we go. We got some crunchy times going on now. Good stuff. Let's go ahead and heal him up while he's up full. Get him back up to par. There we go. There we go. Now you're feeling a little healthier, I think. Okay. Let's go ahead and put down some blocks too, and just, just kind of protect you a little bit here. Because, you know, I feel like that needs to be a thing-ish. Okay, then we can do this here. Because uh, I, I have already had a copy come by. Uh, coyotes have spawned nearby. It's had a bunch of different things that just wanted to say, no, you shouldn't tame this guy. And I'm like, I need to. I need to. So we're going to go at least too high with this. I'm going to get some more, more stuff to build with, I guess. Because we're almost out already. There's that, and there's that. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Uh, there's a bunch of dirt over here, too, so we'll just grab all that. Seropods, parasaurs, just a whole nine yards. Uh, we need to definitely <laughs> get this tame. This tame, we need We need flight again. Lost it to, like, three raptors uh, getting wood. And look, there's another coyote. Two of them. Wow. This headshots with the spear man is just over the top, like, amazing. Um, we lost, yeah, we had like two or three, ra three raptors on us, not two, three raptors on us, and it was just some, just crazy, uh, uh, bad luck, because they got stuck underneath, my pteranodon got stuck underneath them, and you know how pteranodons act, you know, they're like fools, you know what I'm saying? Let's go ahead and get at least a hundred blocks here, we got 60 some odd, almost 70 now. Alright, as long as I don't actually hit something, we should be okay. Famous last words, right, right, I guess we dissed it. Wow, this spear is super OP. Like, seriously, is I'm not complaining. But at least against the stuff like this level, I guess I guess since it's like early mid level mats and stuff, it should be uh, doing that kind of stuff anyway. So, all right, we should have enough to get you set up now, my friend. Keep you safe, safe and sound. And I think something like this is definitely worth building for. Oh my god, I can't be now. We did, however, grab a firefly. She can barely see on my shoulders. But that means we can try out that new firefly wall lantern, too. Because if that's a thing, then we, we won't have to keep putting, like, thatch or wood in our... Or coal, which I won't use. I refuse to use that for our light source. But we can keep taming these guys up and making more wall lights with them. Which I think would be pretty nice, neat and neat, nice. Okay, hopefully that's high enough. We'll go ahead and go up one more just in case because this is this is one of value and I'd hate to lose it. It's like the last five bajillion pteranodons. Oh no, this game is not as as uh stress inducing as let's say the regular arc itself, 
but uh, it, it definitely has stressful moments. I think that's the way to say it. Go and get these guys thrown in here. I would call it a taming pen, I guess. Oops, that's the wrong thing. There we go. There we go. Now we have at least a little bit of protection from like coyotes and stuff. That's probably the coyotes and dodos and everything. Where are you? You're level four. How many times can I hit you? Nope. Nope. Not OP on the flyers, huh? Maybe carnivores are are just no. I was killing the heck out of of that uh coyote. Watch this. Watch how bad I can kill him quickly. Like just immediately is done. What's this? Oh, Dilo. Twenty nine. Okay, you're dead. Okay. Eleven. But a bow will take you out in a second. Bit. This actually registers the hit. See? This is crazy. I'm going to grab the uh, my... Uh, I'm actually going to use my trike on this stuff. Let's check on our... To kill the rest of the stuff so I can get some levels on it. How are you doing here on consciousness? It probably could stand another shot on you. Let's go ahead and do that right now. Full unconsciousness now. All right. Let's get up here. Let's kill this one. And also look at all the berries available to us. And thatch. Now there's a person that is, has a house built here. This stuff will respawn way before he ever gets on or she, they, him, them, they get on. So I'm not, not I don't feel like, like now if it was like a lot of earth, like I'm leaving the flint behind. I'm not touching that. I'm, I just grabbed a little bit of dirt so I could grab this thing and I might just leave the thing there for him. There's a level 19. I thought I could get it dead in time. Nah. Oh, wait, wait, we got to level up. We got to level up. Very nice. Um, I've been putting it in stamina now. This damage is only getting like 2% per, so the stamina seems like a thing. Probably should start putting some in health, too, as much as we're using it for defensive, as well, along with gathering. This thing gathers wood like it's going out of style here. I hate to go by their house and do that. Let me show you right quick. I'll come back by and drop some seeds, maybe, or some saplings. Look at that. 16 wood. I probably would have gotten like 8 or 9 off of that. Gear rabbits, peace out. Hello, Bart. 45? Uh, I might try to tame you too then. We'll do that. Oh my god, I didn't think we, we got that's a 45, you know what I'm saying? Let's grab this meats. Oh, that's a fur. Great. Let's go over here and grab this meats. There we go. Very nice. Uh, I guess we'll throw uh, that down on them too. Maybe get tame up as well. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit something, something, you know what I'm saying? We can have a backup finally. We haven't had a backup yet, really. There we go right there. Crunchy time for you. Peace out to you. Do, 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 do. Oh, yeah, I was going to use you. That's a nice level, though. That is a nice level. I mean, the one I got taming in the in the box is definitely a higher level, but... Get on you and get the kill on. 56 Parasaur? Wow, I didn't even realize. It doesn't really matter, though. They suck. <laughs> uh, maybe we should at least get something up. We'll do that. We'll do that. We'll just do something simple, though. Get this up around you. Yeah, so I just want to show you the taming going on right now. And uh, let's we'll go, we'll go ahead and get this thing continuing on. And we'll be right back. You guys, hold on. Welcome back. We have returned, as you can probably easily tell. Because I said, welcome back. That's the international thing of we returned this. Uh, we are here. I am taming three Tranodons. I uh, leveled this one up. They got three levels on it. Uh, the damage seems like not worth putting it into. Either it does health. Uh, the next one will be put in. I put one in a weight. It gave it about 18 weight, which is, you know, okay. I want to try stamina next because it's so pumped up already anyway. I want to see how well it does. Here's the third one we tamed. This cobalt is 540 base stamina versus the 810. That's a nominal amount, especially between, what, like 13 levels. So you can see there the difference. A uh, health 399 versus your 336. Yeah, so there's a varying amount of HP. So there's another 399. I guess when it tamed, it did reroll stats. Maybe I don't know. Uh, 427 weight, 371. So there's a, there's a varying amounts of stuffs here. The stamina on you is amazing. So that's a big plus. Uh, I did cook a bunch of stuff at the campfire and went back over here. Ended up clearing out this whole spot, made it ready to take foundations all the way out a few few pellices too. 
So uh, that's that's a good start. That's a good start. A good start. So let's look at our inventory. We have a lot of berries and stuff. Maybe we need to go ahead and grab a couple stacks of woodses. Grab, grab, grab a couple stacks of thatch and And maybe grab one stack of the fiber just in case. Now let's see what it takes to make a feeding trough. Feeding trough right there. Bam. What is that? A feed pot. To make kibble. Oh, nice. Okay, craft item. And let's go ahead and see how this looks. Okay. Let's put it over here in front of like one of the dinos and see what it looks like. Right there. Like right. Th oh, that's pretty cool. Let's see what it looks like when we put berries in it and stuff. And meatses. Uh, those are all cooked meats though. Oh, it shows full. Oh, very nice. There's no logo. Oh, there is a logo over top that shows feeding trough. Okay. Why is there? There's one very faintly above you. Okay. Let's grab your raw meatses. And the carrion ones and throw it in here too. Excuse me, excuse me. And let's put where's the carrion go? Where the carrion right there? Bam. Alright, so let's look at the shelf life on this now. Spoils in 16 minutes, 57 minutes. Okay, let's see this guy. It spoils in 15. Transferred over there. An hour. Okay, we're gonna put our meats in here too. How much room do we have? We have a good amount of room in there too. We'll put our taste of meats in here and we'll put the narcos and all that stuff in there. How about egg wise? Seven days. 31 days. Okay. We have a place to store all of our stuff to store, right? All right. Good stuff. Okay. Let's grab all this. Let's grab all your stuff. Uh, take all. Thank you very much. Are you happy about that or not? I can't tell. The meats is in there. That stuff. We don't need to put the this in there. That's definitely not necessary. Put that in there. So you in here. Let's go ahead and take a... Oops. Wrong thing again. Wow. I wanted to open this thing. There we go. There we go. Okay, put that in there. Put this in here. Put this in there. Let's grab the stack of Majos. Put it back on my bar. Let's put this raw in there, too. We don't need to have that on us. Uh, crunchy time. That's really nice to have a place to put all the crunchy times at. I'm just saying, take all. You don't need any dirtiness. on, And don't need any dirty foods on you, so we'll give the options of something else should it come around. Which I don't know if that will ever be a thing. Okay, and then you go in there. Excellent, 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 excellent. Let's get to snaps if I can. Snaps, you had stuff on you. No, we got it all. We picked it up from you when we picked you up. All right, let's grab all your tasted meats. Oh, I did kill a mushroom. You can see there. Wow, you had a lot of stuff on you. You should be doing better now. And uh, wow, I'm, I'm ratherly, ratherly weighed down a little bit. Let's get, take out all your meats. So we're going to keep you here and keep you here as well. That's a lot of raw meat, man. Okay, so is there anything random in here? Does it got a timer on it? It does have a timer. Truffle. Okay, if I eat truffle seeds, eat it to gain a tiny amount of nourishment. Use it to make delicious food in the cooking item. Okay. We'll put that in there. Capable of stunning enemies. Poisonous mushroom. Okay. Looks kind of familiar. Light mushrooms always grow in caves. Okay, biolicence. And let's throw in as much. Actually, we can do this. Transfer same items. Okay. So this bad boy is filled out, generally speaking. Let's do this too. So let's do this. This should fill out what we need to get rid of. You know what I mean? 20, 20, 20, 20. All these are 20, right? They are. So I think I'm going to go and do another trough. Let's craft a trough. What is this? Trap door. Okay. Okay. I gotcha. There's this one here. Okay, let's put you on nine. And let's put this down a little bit further, like maybe right there. And we'll go ahead and put all the raw meats in there. Transfer all the same items. Transfer same items. Okay, can we put one in there or something? And then maybe do it. There we go. Let's go ahead and take all the raw meats out of you then. There, and that should be more than enough. Let's go ahead and transfer singularly to fill out everything we got. So the 20s out. There we go. And I put the 20 stuff in there. There we go. How much room you got left? You got plenty of room. You got plenty of room. Uh, let's go ahead and search for raw. Yeah, let's just do meat then. There we go. That's all the raw meats, these. And so we'll put the stuff in here that we cannot really eat. I guess we should put the carrion in here too if we have enough room. How much carrion do we have on this piece? Wow, we got to do some mount in here. 
Okay, let's take that. So this raw meat's in there too with it and then put the carrion in. Very nice. So we now have us a couple troughs up that are going to make the meats last a heck of a lot longer. Everybody has food, crunchy times now. That's very nice. Uh, we still have some berries on you, do we not? We barely have any berries on you. Do you have any berries on you? You do not, okay. And we have the firefly, I threw him in there. It's like gonna be safe at times. You know, be kind of safe to go. Whoa, well, what your tails? I've always hated raptor tails. They've always been like that. They always will be too, John. I know that, I'm aware, I'm aware. Okay, so we got that. Now there's something else cool that we ended up making or finding, not making. Um, we have a raptor claw. And if we look at our engrams, there's this raptor claw thing. It can be sharp, razor claws are extremely sharp. So let's see what that does for us. We have two claws now, so let's check this out. Uh, workbench. Wrap. Tur right there. Bam. Can be crafted at the... It is 100% whiff of damage, okay? All right, let's see what you look like. Raptor claws. Liberator. One on our bar. Okay, can we, do we have to equip you, I guess? Can I put you in an offhand or something? No. Okay, nine. <gasps> oh, snap. Okay, and it doesn't really tell us how much damage it does, but it looks cool. Wait, nine. Okay, that's pretty cool. Hopefully we can put them in offhand too. That'd be kind of, that'd be really nice if we could do end up doing that. Cool. Is there something with a trike thing? Cause I got a trike skull too. Trike, nothing that I can see right now on you. How about you, V-Track? There's a track and stuff, lifting stations, industrial magic buffs. Okay, 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 that's fine, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, now I wanna look at this Western setup here too. I think we have to craft us another one of these HUD tables. <laughs> I keep making them and then destroying them as is how it goes sometimes. I probably save some, some cash flow if I would just, just HUD and then maybe we could go and make this HUD too. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. We're going to walk over here while we're crafting it for five hours. Oh, we also are, uh, I don't have a spot exactly for it yet. Um, I feel like, well, we can put it right there for right now. Let's do that. Uh, another DIY, which is the rec decorative hut. Put you on six. And hopefully we're going to slam you right here for right now again. Awesome. And we're going to end up doing dinos oh i can do that okay there it is there that takes clay with it let's see your storage right there bam so we need yellow dye for that okay i just destroyed the dye table <laughs> oh, uh, uh, uh. And it looks like i put the decorative hut down didn't i yes i did it's great okay let's put this one next to it then if it'll let me uh six yeah well okay can i move it back one no Fine, fine, okay. Structure, stone, marble, wild, wild wood, western wood. Okay, doors and stuff like that. Why does that say wild though? That's kind of funny. Uh, stone, okay, fine stone wall. So we need to go ahead. I made a bunch of stone foundations, regular ones. This is gonna be the stone foundations box or stone box. There's the ceilings there. Oh, I made a bunch of ceilings. Where's the, ha, derp -derp. And the most of the rocks right here right now. All right, let's do stone foundations right here to craft all. That's 430 of them suckers. I guess we should go ahead and wait till I get done with that. Come back. I'll go ahead and lay some of these foundations down and get things shuffled around some more. So you guys, hold on. Welcome back. We have a nice shiny platformed area. You can see where it's a little bit colder outside somewhere around here, or maybe it just warmed up. I don't know. You can see the different of the light though on there. I'm, I'm wondering if that's just the water influencing it. There is clay below that holding it in place. So I don't really know. I don't really know. Don't know what to say. So we're gonna throw these guys back in here. I'm gonna go into the special one. I know I have walls already made somewhere. Where'd my walls go? I thought I had more walls than... Oh my god, it's crazy. Let's throw the fine ones in there. Let's throw these in there. All right, we have some... I thought I had a heck of a lot more made, actually. Just in here, we have a bunch of stone ceiling, stone walls. All right, let's get this done. And I'm going to get these crafting up while we were working. 
All right, craft stone walls. Okay, and we need to make a couple of these guys too, I think. Uh, I think there might be an upgraded version too. Let's find out though. Two, three, and one, two, one. I'm guessing we need more stone. Rock, if you will. Uh, stone. There's a doorway. We probably need to work on that. Have a couple of those. Let's do a couple windows first. There's five going right now. So let's, let's meander over here. I did get attacked by Onik. And it destroyed the, the, the decoration one. So that's great. It's beautiful. Okay, so let's go into you. We got those guys already made. Let's go to stone. Let's go into the walls first. 100, 100. And then let's do the ceilings. One, two, three, four, three of those. Okay. It's kind of loud going on here. And let's go ahead and grab our walls now and see what we can do here. I want to keep this gate the way it is. Maybe we could do something like this on it and kind of like match the sides so we have glass on either end. I don't know. Let's see. There's that. Uh, can you come over another one? You can. Good stuff. Sorry, I can't jump right now. I just need to deal with what I got. There we go there. Okay, well, let me build there because of the obstructed thing right there. So let's go ahead and come out another one here. And we'll be matching it up with the other side exactly, too. So that's nice. Okay, and then our corners are here. So let's go ahead and build some corners up. Building the windows now. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. I would hate to fall in right now and not be able to get back out. Okay, so let's go ahead and do structures. Stone. All the walls. Okay, that looks like it's doing everything. Now let's grab the walls we have made already. Those are regular stone walls. Where are the fine ones? There they are right there. Bam. Fine young walls. Perfect. Okay, let's put this here. Get up top and kind of do the whole jumpy thing. There we go. Get a little corner out of that. Let's also do that here, but first let's go top here and get this guy first. All right, one more. Okay. Okay. And then... There we go. Looks pretty good. Looks pretty good. Let's go to this corner now and get this one set up. There, one, two, three. I'll go one too high there, I think. Yeah, I think we did. I think when you click too fast, it does definitely use up mats that aren't getting placed, which sucks. Okay, we should be able to go up like this without a problem. That seropod's up there too, acting all crazy, man. Uh, 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 there we go. Let's see seropod tail. Great. Did I grab any ceilings? Find stone ceilings. Bam. All right, let's get this film that hole right there. It needs to go in right there. And then we put, oh, we're out of those now. And that did go up one too high across the board. I can't really tell. Oh my God. I got to grab you. Got some more ceilings already going. So that's great. So let's grab that. We have these off walls. Good stuff. All right, let's check out what we can do with the ceiling here because it should come out across. Just not a problem at all. Oh, right there. Kind of help out some with this. Okay, let's put a one across. Now, there we go. Now that looks pretty good. All right, let's put you right there. Okay. We also need to clear out these spots. Um, That's so why that corner won't get hit up. I probably could repair you now. Can I repair you? I cannot. Dang it. That that seropod man is freaking loud too. My lord. Okay, let's grab these ceilings up here and come over. Don't want to go over too far because then I'll fall off the side. There we go. Uh, that's gonna suck to get there. So let's just do this. Okay, that should let me reach up there, kind of. There 
There we go. Nice. Nice, 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 nice. Working within the rules of the game, right? There we go. Then let's come across this way. And come out some more, please. Okay. Get you up there to... Come on. There you go. Let's go grab these pieces up. Got some more walls here now. That should make it very easy now. Yeah, there we go. And come back across. Is that too high? It is too high. Well, it's not. It's too low. And I want to go ahead and place this guy here, I guess. Um, I really wish we could pick up those stations. That'd be really super nice, or super cool of them, and they'd let us do that. Oh, come on. Don't stay stuck right there. There we go. Maybe we'll go up there when I jump. There we go. Excellent, excellent. That's excellent. excellent. Good, 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 good. So we should have put these up without too much problem. Yep, that's exactly what I thought would happen. Okay, so we have these in now. I just want to leave this bottom row in here because I want to put glass in. I think I think glass would look kind of cool. For that, uh, I feel like, okay, here's our main walkway in. We're trying to build something for that. So let's go ahead and do a corner for this as well. All right. Oops, we missed out one. Oops, oops my bad, my bad. My bad. There we go, one right there. Excellent. Okay, we can do this one here now. Let's go ahead and get the ceiling up there too. Nice. I get the ceiling across here. Is this right? Is this right? It looks like it is. This is one more wider. Oops. Oopsie. All right, so let's do this one more wider. My bad. Okay, get rid of those guys there. All right, now we're going to do this and try this out again. This way we can kind of make a cool little entrance too, I think. It would be nice. There we go. There's that. And then we're going to go up here. Excellent. Okay, cool. Let's do this side now. Get that in here. Very nice. I'm pretty, pretty extremely happy with this. I'm just going to say that, how it's kind of shaping, and I'm looking forward to putting the glass up. It's going to look so cool. I might not even put a bottom on that. This little corner here looks pretty cool, though. Oops, my bad. Yeah, I guess we should put a bottom on there if we're going to kind of have a match. That miasma thing is happening again. Okay, uh, and that kind of did not go all the way across, so let's go ahead and see if I can get it up there. Uh, there we go, and let's get this one up. And we're going to have to destroy... Or this 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 build crafting station before we can do anything else with that, and that kind of sucks. I was thinking about putting them over here once we get everything lined up. Maybe even just do some wood floors up into it too. Actually, that looks like that would work right here. We could do an odd number of them. And that's kind of part of building. You kind of get the things down. At least we can pick up the pieces in this game. We don't have to sit here and just like like, dang it, I can't believe I chose to do that instead. Right, let's go over here and grab this. I am dehydrated. Find water soon. Okay, I will. I will. Just give me a minute. We're, we're working here. We're working here. We also have those stone windows, too. Hmm. Do you have anything left in here? You should. Yeah, you do. Okay, great. Let's, let's actually destroy you again. Oh, we had a piece missing there. Okay. There we go. 
All right, so let's go ahead and get the wooden, this here. And they're all facing the same direction, which is great. Let's try this up here now. Okay, so let's try and build this. Uh, wait, 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 wait. How are these windows looking? I want to see how big or small these guys are. Oh, they're not that bad. I don't think they're going to work with what we're doing here. I think I want the glass up. Let's grab the glass walls. Not in this one. Is it in this one? Not in this one. Is it in this one? It's in this one. Good stuff. I think we're going to need more glass walls, too, it looks like. So that means we need to grab some glass, which I have, I think, in this one. I magic dirt. There's ice. There's snow. Oops, I mean to grab the snow. I guess I don't have any glass in this one. I thought I had some glass somewhere. Oh, there it is. Excellent. But I just broke all the, the things. <laughs> all right, let's see what we can get done with what we have here. That snaps a little weird for me. And this way we can still have a view of our lovely exterior exterior area whilst having protection. Okay, let's do this one now. And that's all I have for that. Um, it looks like I should actually pull this over by one. Grab those pieces now. Okay. Now let's do the huts again. So we'll have both huts in here. We'll throw those down. I'm going to go ahead and craft up a bunch more glass and glass in where I feel like I need to. And then, uh, yeah, we'll come right back. So you guys, hold on. All right, guys. We're back. And, uh,. Kind of got the pieces together. I'm going to end up filling up the top with this, I think, with the uh, stone ceilings. Just because it's like we're having it filled on the top anyway. So that's going to be a thing. Um, let's go ahead and start putting some of that up here while we're to Oh, my God. No, no, no. Okay, okay, do it here at least. Yeah, and then the other side has a nice glass roof. I think it looks good that way. I think there's a nice contrast, but it's still cohesive type of thing going on. And these end up fitting in here. I pulled up the wood because the wood pieces just did not look good for the floors. I tried. I'm not going to force it if it doesn't want to. You know how that goes. You know what I'm saying? You know how that goes. Let's see, can I fit any? Oh, they want to snap there now. Great. We'll get up what we can, and then I'll come from the top or something and fill it in. Or make some stepping stones or something and get up there. There we go. That one went up there pretty nice. Maybe go around the back end of this and do it. Where did that go? Go in the hole. Okay, there's still a couple holes left to do. Yeah, we we'll have to figure something out for that. But you know, these are these. Are, oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! We found out something for that one. Dang, bang, and boom. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh! Uh, we had that. It was showing somewhat up there. There we go. We only got a couple of the holes to fill in for that. This one, I'm not really sure yet what I want to do there. I actually want to get into some different building materials and kind of change how that looks. And maybe do something else to add some designs. I was going to build something like a cross or something in there, but it ended up taking up too much space to do that. It's even one way, odd the other way, which is fine. I think it's my fault for not having measured it out. But it still looks pretty good for a very smooth looking face. So these right here for now. Very nice. Go and just fill this in all the way across. That way we can do our thingy thing pretty easily. Like landing here. My bad. Oops, I don't have it on. But anyway, so we got a bunch of stuff the other day. We lost the pteranodons. We gained pteranodons. We gained pteranodons. We built stuff. We got a little extension built on here. So we have a nice little safety cubby hole here. Probably end up filling up the ceiling here off camera just so we can get this all done. Maybe we can do something with the staples next time. I'm not really sure just yet. Let's fill in that hole just in case something just drops by. Not anymore. But yeah, anyway, guys, we want to take you guys and tell you guys thank you so much for hanging out today. Hope you found something you like. Find something you like. Don't forget to slam the like button. This helped me a lot. Really do appreciate it. 
And um, as always, guys, thank you so very much. And you have yourselves a good night. Mm.